Hi, this is Nathan, your neighborhood arcade and pinball talk guy. We're going to be reviewing House of Diamonds Retro uh, on Steam and Zakaria today. Uh, please look for our review under the description of our YouTube video under the little triangle. You can click that and get the metrics uh, for our review, as well as like and follow us on our social media formats, Arcade and Pinball Talk, under Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, as well as YouTube. Click that red subscribe button right now. Anyway, let's go ahead and get this review underway, shall we? First things first, very nice table. Uh, layout is very unique, and uh, it is going to be very hard. Uh, most of these uh, EM slash solid states uh, made back in the day, especially uh, Zakaria. Some people will say Zakaria, which is their name. I call it Zakaria. I just think it's got a better flow to it. It kind of comes off the tongue easier too. But anyway, with that said, uh, great looking table so far. Uh, it's got the quad flippers at the base of this uh, this uh, play field. And uh, you do have some uh, stop pegs that are to the edges of the left and the right of the flippers, which make it a little bit easier to control the ball. See, it bumps it. That way it gives you a little bit more of a chance to play. So that, that, that makes it a little bit easier. Although, don't get me wrong, it's still a hard table, period. Uh, just because of the layout of this table. Uh, anyway, you have some rollovers with the table mechanics to the left and right. Some slings pointing right back at your flippers. That makes it a little bit higher of a difficulty. Uh, a bunch of pop bumpers to the top. Uh, and then some columns that you're trying to get into with some stops to the left and the right. So really, your only way to get up there is to shoot it straight in the middle. And then, of course, you have some rails that come out uh, with some guides that, that allow you to have the ball come out and hit those uh, mushroom bumpers to the left and the right. So all in all, very, very difficult table. Shats in that thing trying to get it up there. Let's go. Get it in there. Anyway, pretty nice. I mean, graphically, it looks good for what it is. And, of course, they've done a very good job kind of bringing the art back on this thing and making it look like it's, it's new age. Uh, you know, the only thing I wish that they would do is put some soundtrack to it and, uh, you know, have some music jamming on it. Because so, some of these older EM uh, banger and clangers is what I call them. The old EMs are all banging and clanging. Uh, but that's how you can tell. If you hear the bing bing, uh, that's, a, that's a banger and a clanger. That's generally an EM. Some solid states still do that. But generally in the earlier solid states, you're starting to get Galaga noises and afterburner noises and maybe some sound bites and stuff like that. It started evolving from there. But... Anyway, with this table, very fun game. Uh, I think the layout is good, even with the quad bump uh, flippers. Uh, I think that uh, that adds to the difficulty level. Uh, please look for the rest of our metrics underneath the description of our YouTube video. There's a little triangle there. Click on it, find the metrics, as well as click that red subscribe button. Thank you again for watching today, and we look forward to our next video with you guys.